What's good, TMG fam? It's your boy, Ellen. and I'm back with another reaction. How y'all feel? Welcome back to the channel. Salute. Now, real quick, before we even get started, let's address it. You know, I've been getting hit up, hit up, hit up, constantly, constantly questioned, wondering if what I think, this, that, and the third, and my answer to the up church situation is this. It's none of my business. Simple. I mean, I can't get more simple and plain than that. That's that man's personal life. Respect his privacy, respect his family, respect everything going around, and leave that alone, bro. That's personal. I would never want to get into that or comment on none of that, man. That's just not how I rock, like, right there. Leave that alone. It's too personal. Let him be. Have his fun. We here for the music, bro, and that's what it's about. So shout outs to my guy, Up Church. He just dropped some new music, a new remix. This is called Skill Shot. The Kill Shot remix. And then, of course, my guy is bored. So when he bored, you know what you about to get. An onslaught of bars, an onslaught of music. And that's what I'm here for. So salute to the homie, Up Church. We're going to get into this. If you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button, man. And join the fam. Let's go. A good percentage of these fucking, these rappers, you know, they call themselves rappers or whatever. Man, how does that make... Okay, so say say you are a rapper, right? You know what I'm saying? Say you're a rapper, I'm a rapper, whatever. You've been in the game for a good ten years, whatever, whatever. And then some dude comes in that is naturally a country artist and bosses you up. Put your seatbelt on, you're gonna need it in a minute. I ain't scared to die. Left rappers try to ride with me. I'ma make you fall off, cause I pop mad willies. You just suck while I'm sucking them mad titties on bad bitches. Ah! Yeah, straight from the countryside. Ah! That's how you bring in a song, right? That's how you bring it in. Then say you're a rapper, I'm a rapper, whatever. And then some dude comes in that is naturally a country artist. He sound like, Church sound like he recharged. He sound like he recharged, he rejuvenated. He sound like we about to get a bunch of music the way he come in on that right there. And bosses you up. Put your seatbelt on, you're gonna need it in a minute. I ain't scared to die, left rappers try to ride with me. I'ma make you fall off, cause I pop mad willies. You just suck while I'm sucking them mad titties on bad bitches. Bad bitches. Yeah, straight from the countryside, bum a sick thin ass. Can I bum a fucking ride? That's like a record label Lamborghini looking fresh. Army green paint, mud cake, throw the head press. I'm the rooster, no need for career boosters. I'll be blowing up a rest of professional scam floaters. Got a degree in winning, so I'm unable to be a loser. Hip hop is my drug, bitch. I'm an everyday user. <laughs> I feel him. Even I have to say, ooh, after that line. Even I had to say, ooh, after that line right there. And I didn't even know that was coming. Booster, no need for career boosters. I'll be blowing up aggressive professional scam floaters. Got a degree in winning, so I'm unable to be a loser. Hip hop is my drug, bitch. I'm an everyday user. Woo! Rick Flair with them nose hairs and enough. Don't be killing hibernate grizzly bears sleeping on me. So it's only fair I jump up in your nightmare like Freddy Krueger ain't working 10 years. I'm in the head now. All they see is a guy in a snow, but that's me driving. North Pole, pal. I can get so dark, the sun will be scared to pop, pop, pop. Discredited for the past three years. I know a lot of motherfuckers that owe me beers, and you're gonna give it to me. I ain't even saying cheers. I ain't even saying. I owe you a beer, bro. I owe you a beer. When you come to Atlanta, hot leg, yo, when you step foot in Atlanta, I got you, bro. Not one of these haters you throwing shots at talking about they, they owe you beer. I owe you a beer just for, just for everything, bro. Everything that you've done. Everything you've just done for me, salute, you know what I mean? Showing love and, and things you didn't have to do. So, and, and out of that, respectfully, I owe you a beer. So when you touch down in Atlanta, bro, holla at me. Thanks, I ain't even taking one drink. Throw it on the ground and tell the bartender you bought it. And says a kick you when you're not singing the esophagus, then invite you to a hit hop party around six. As a corner of second avenue, where yeah, suck a dick. If you still sleeping on me, won't you grab a tit? Just make sure it ain't a chick trying to boost her income, kid. Don't fucking fire me unless you want to get cremated for making me Mr. Bait. Why you hang with your ex, baby? Let's be honest. I'm still a top doggy dog, and then I'm hungry, and I'm hardly tired of harsh walking. You ain't got a song that's independently chart topping. You couldn't be a shocking career if it had a fucking dog collar. Hope you like your number one. <laughs> Yo, man, when somebody got a, got a tongue as sharp as a sword, bro, you got to leave them alone, man. You got to leave them alone. When when a person is 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 that talented, you can't really mess with them, bro. It's, it's all fun at the end of the day for him. You know what I'm saying? When it's easy and it's fun and it comes natural to you, that's dangerous. 
That's dangerous. Leave a person like that. Let them be, bro. <laughs> Let them be. And that let's be honest line. Yeah, unless you want to get cremated for making me Mr. Bait while you hang with your ex, baby. Let's be honest. I'm still a top doggy dog, and then I'm hungry and I hardly tired of harsh walking. You ain't got a song that's independently chart topping. You couldn't be a shocking career if it had a fucking dog dollar. Hope you like your number one hit song. I had to buy a leash and pretty much fucking walk you to it, you little bitch. I mean, female rapper doodle. Her raps are Mona Lisa, yours are like half a doodle. I'm rapping for the purse like a bag of poodle. Country rap, I'm gonna be the fucking last to do it. I killed five careers with only words and math. We can't chop it up, but. Can you dodge a sack? I'm gonna make you a pass rap on a fact. My cards are secretly raising. Whew. <laughs> That's all you can say, man. You gotta be like, whew. Bro. Ha. Ah. Huh. Ah. And, and, and I don't even wanna say he's angry. I just wanna say, man. He just had some stuff like he felt like he needed to get off his chest. Like, like I don't want to say that. Because when you apply somebody angry, it's like they're not really in the right frame of mind. They're not thinking and stuff like that. No, 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 no. <laughs> his thoughts is concise. You know what I mean? His target is in lock. His targets is in lock. Bro, that's dangerous. That's pretty dangerous. Can't chop it up, but can you dodge a sack? I'ma make you a pass rap on a fact. My cards are secretly razor blades, meant to look like blackjack. Ain't no dodging me, not even when I scat pack. The GT got tension to wreck anybody on the last lap. Whoops, that was an accidental love tap. I was watching this vid of a guy and he was real mad. You could tell he loved her, but she played him. It was real sad. Now my attitude is the rap heads and glad bags. I cannot believe you. <laughs> yeah, what the fuck? Now I'm colder than the songs I wrote, and I'm coming for you if you got a throat. Who look down on me like I'm shit or something? Fuck the CMAs, fuck the CMTs, fuck the VH1 and both MTVs. You're a broken record, at least I'm gold. When these rappers diss me, it becomes our biggest song. It's a shotgun shame, it's been half a decade. They got two dweebs, still having me make a short change. And I ain't even seen a short change. You still got ass bars and a dork name. You're a woody doll that ain't too much cake. Oh wait, a cartoon, 100% fake. Look at Big Star getting picked apart like a demolition derby and only one little smart car. I like fair body Chevys. Now you like ball sex and daddies. And that's <laughs> But he just told you you like boss and daddy. That's this. That's disrespectful. <laughs> ha! Hold up, man. Oh, that's disrespectful. Daddy Chevys. Now you like boss sex and daddies. <laughs> oh man. Whoever whoever he just told that to, bro. Either, either you got to retaliate with something like something crazy or you just need to tuck your tail and go home, bro. <laughs> when a man tell you you like ball sex and daddies, bro. Oh, man. At that point in time, you got to fight him, bro. That's just the ultimate disrespect. A smart car. I like fair body Chevys. Now you like ball sex and daddies. And that's why you and Chris take a lead each other on a futon and you fucking Snapchat stream. I give an evil grin. You think that you're real man, real man. Don't bitch like a diva on Instagram. Any hard worker really can't come see this shit. Your last video was a knockoff of Starface, bitch. Uh, Can you even start a chainsaw? Cause Lord knows you ain't got any bar old. Hit cop party more like flipped over bar So with you and Hoja sitting on it like, dude, this is cold. Baby, you can't butt heads with me. Shane's last video was only sitting on three. And on my way home, I'll quadruple your stats. Cause your square body Chevy be sitting on flat. With your boy in the back screaming, I ain't got gas. You're so non sharp, you couldn't cut dead grass. And you suck more than the best blowjob facts. Every real skin knows you blow a smoke out your ass. Y'all should be like gay redneck porn stars. Travel together dressed like. Hey man, these dudes gotta be upset and thankful at the same time, bro. They gotta be upset because <laughs> because of the onslaught of bars coming their way, the, the ultimate disrespect coming their way. But at the same time, it's giving them attention. And church doesn't have to do that. So it's kind of like remember when L was battling cannabis, and then after they got done, L like gave props to cannabis. You know what I'm saying? And cannabis had to 
to to L gave him props because it, it like refueled him and sparked his you know what I mean his career and just you know what I mean gave him a new sense of energy. Cannabis had to thank him because it kind of it blew cannabis up a little more. It, it gave him a certain status. So these dudes that Church is talking about need to be thankful that he's even addressing them because he ain't even have to address them. And then your your dishes or whatever would have fell flat on his face. So the fact that he's addressing y'all, y'all still should be mad, but at the same time thankful as well. It's a tough, it's a tough place to be in. I know, I know. Noises can spill y'all some pussies with some fuzzy rap toys. Fucking weirdos. <laughs> oh man, yo yo, my guy is rejuvenated, he coming back. He barring everybody to death, and it's probably a bunch of music about the about the spawn from this. So. uh Shout outs to church, man. Shout outs to y'all. I know it's been a minute, but we back like we never left. It's your boy L to the next reaction of my piece. Y'all stay solid. <laughs>